Hello! Happy Thursday! Um, I have no idea what's going on with my hair today. It is being ridiculous. So I'm trying to like figure out. Oh, I forgot to take a before picture. That's okay. Before pictures always look the same. It's always, hey, this is what I look like when I wake up with nothing on. I don't look good. Hi, Ashley. Uh, so I have no idea what I'm doing with my hair right now. So I'm just trying to like, we're just gonna put it in a bun for right now. Hi, Megan. Just to kind of get it out of my way. It's annoying me. Um, okay, so, great, great, great news, but also sad news, because I'm a little sad about it. Um, so our cream luminizers, these babies, they are retiring at the end of the month, okay? They will be discontinued um, until supplies last. They are half off, okay? So half off on my website, alanaprettyandpink.com. Uh, which is an amazing deal considering these are normally $39. They're going to be $19.50. And you get free shipping because there's still free shipping going on for the next 1 million orders. However, I know we're close to that number. We're about, I think they said like 850,000 orders in. So only 150,000 more orders to get the free shipping. So just a big deal. Alright, so I'm going to show you my favorite way to use the, um, Luminizer, and I'm also showing off some new products I got in today. Super excited. Uh, so I'm really pumped about that. So what I like to do for the Luminizer, and I'll show you a few different ways too. Um, number one, I love this stuff, so I'm really sad. Um, I do like the stick and the powder more, but this is going to work out great. So this is the color Benevolent, and let me just show you a nice swatch of it on the back of my hand. This is Benevolent. It's a golden frost. It's a nice shimmer. I'm trying to like get the lighting just right. So it's a nice shimmer color, okay? It's perfect for fair skin, perfect for dark skin actually too. Um, a lot of these colors, people are like, oh well opaline's too dark for me, opaline's our darkest. I wear opaline and it looks really good. So it's just a matter of preference. Um, do I have any others that are close by to me? Oh, I have per iridescent. Iridescent is one of my other favorites. Um, it is a white shimmer. So it's a white shimmer. Hi, Sam. So that is the white shimmer. That is our, um, another one of our, what's up, bae? One, another one of our colors. And then pearly is like a rose gold kind of color, which I like a lot. Pearly I'll use on my arms. I'll show you too today how I do that. Um, so this one is pearly. So these are just three of the five colors. They are discontinuing and they are half off right now on my website, which is a killer steal. And I would not pass this up. So again, this is pearly, benevolent, and iridescent. Um, they all have a really nice natural shimmer to them. So definitely get your hands on them um, before they're gone. We still have the powders and the sticks, but the creams are great because you can really work them into your foundation and get a great look which is what I'm gonna do today. All right, so I feel like I have like pudgy cheeks. Mm -hmm. All right, so I have my primer on already, so I'm gonna show you what I like to do. So this is Benevolent, which is my favorite. I did this yesterday and I was like in love with how it looked. So I'm using just about that much. And I put it on the tops of my cheeks already. And blending it in, a little on my forehead, on my nose. A little under my brows chin just a tad upper lips this is also a great like quick fix makeup you know say you don't really want to put foundation on but you want to have that sun kiss glow look at this already like look how nice and shimmery and pretty that looks already I'm obsessed so you get that nice sheen and having that it's that no makeup makeup look that everyone loves right now Everyone wants that no makeup makeup look. I'm about to put a hat on. My hair is pissing me off. It is not cute. Maybe I'll put a hat on. Hold on. That's better, much better. Someone said it looked like a shower cap I was wearing last week, and I was cracking up at that. I was like, didn't think about that, but now I am. So, and it was my dog's instructor. <laughs> All right, so, new products. New products. I got in the new press powders. So this is Camlet. I hate this little sponge thing. I just like swatched it earlier. I'm not a fan of the sponge thing, so I won't use it. All right, so this is Camlet. 
This is one of the newest colors. Oh, thanks, Sam. I love you. Um, this is one of our newest colors. It is compatible with people who are organza. Um, also, look at the... They, like, imprinted the um, logo onto that. How awesome is that? Like, how awesome is that? Hi, Camden. So, they imprinted the logo onto these. Obsessed! So, now if anyone's like, oh, what are you using? Oh, you know, just my unique. Uh, ooh, almost closed it wrong. All right, so... <laughs> Next up, I also got in the new loose powder. I also got Camlet. And also, I like how they, um, so this is the, this is just a right, random color. This is the old, how it looks with the loose powder. This is the new. Um, They're about the same size, but I actually think the newer ones are slightly bigger. So that's cool. I like how sleek this cover is. They did the same with the pressed powders. So here, I'll show you. This is the pressed powder original. This is the new pressed powder. So they really kind of amped it up. Big fan. Big fan. Alright, so it looks super, super good. Um, but I'm going to use the pressed powder today because I really want to see how it feels. Um, I did a little swatch on my arm, but of course I want to see how it looks on my skin. So I do have my Benevolent Luminizer on. And next up, we're going to apply this foundation on. So I'm going to do half my face to start, just to kind of see. So this hat's going to have to come off, and you guys are going to have to see my awful hair today. Like, just awful. Just not cute. Alright, so we're using a powder puff brush. Just one little swirl got me that much product. So again, this is the color Camlet. I'm applying it to half of my face. And you guys can see the golden frost of Benevolent is still coming through, but it's subtle. Not extreme. Ooh, this feels like really good. So, pressed powders are usually best for oily um, combination normal skin. I have dehydrated skin, I get told a lot, but... In the summer, my skin tends to come around a little bit more, so I know it's going. this is going to be, like, um, a really good product for me. Especially because it's so quick to put on. Like, look how quick I covered up half my face. I need to get out in the sun. I'm, like, super pale. So, this is nothing on the side of my face except for my luminizer, which you guys can see. It's really a nice highlight. And this is with the camlet on my skin and still that little bit of nice highlight poking through. Just trying to get my neck like it's weird like my neck and my me whatever all right so what do you guys think it feels really good on it's nice and soft it's not heavy at all um usually with powders i start to like freak out because i'm like <gasps> i can't breathe with it on i don't have that feeling with this so this is really good all right so let's finish up the rest of our face i'm gonna have to do like i'll do it before and after i'll do my before from yesterday picture like i said your before is always going to look the same. Your makeup's not going to look the same, but your before is always going to look the same. So sometimes I'm just like, eh, we're going to keep it. Thanks, girl. And this is a buildable coverage, too, now. So before, pressed powders were just kind of, it was buildable to an extent where really you were just adding on more and more stuff. This is much more buildable. Oh, the little logo's going away. Um... So you can keep adding on with product. Getting our neck and our chest. I like everything to blend together. I get more on this side. to get our neck. All right, cool. So we have a nice natural glow going on. See how pretty? And you can still see the luminizer. I just got to blend there a little bit more. You can still see the luminizer poking through just enough. So it's not a crazy amount. All right. So now that we've done a cream luminizer and then a powder, we're not going to go back to cream. Cream, uh, you don't want to do cream, powder, cream, or you never want to do powder than cream. That's going to make everything like very sticky think of like when you combine lotion with baby powder hi Kendra and like you get that weird consistency where it's like I don't know it's kind of gross how I'm going to describe it but like curdled milk <laughs> um so when you get that weird consistency 
that's not what you want. So once you switch over to powder, stay at powder, okay? Stay at powder. All right, I'm gonna do a little bit of bronzer still. So, excuse me, beachfront bronzer in Mabu. And then we're going to use, so I have to tell you my sad story. In the middle of the night the other night, in my middle of the night, I mean like really early, my dog was yelling at me because he needed to go out. He needed to go out. Um, I had a container of brushes kind of perched a little precariously, so this is kind of my fault, on um, my uh, basket of laundry. Came in, came back from letting him out, went back to bed, and it fell. And so all of my brushes, I had to rewash them, and I'm talking a big bag of brushes. Luckily, some of them were saved. Some of them weren't in there. Some were downstairs. So I just washed them all. And I hate washing my brushes, but I put on Netflix and I was like, all right, we're going to chill and do this. Netflix and chill while we do our, clean our brushes. That makes sense, right? Ah! All right, that was fine. It's fine. All right, so we're blending in. I don't know why, like, I'm super pale lately. I need to go outside in the sun. I need to go play in the sun. But we all know it will. I'll show you guys that in a second. All right, so next up is eyebrows. Let's do some eyebrows. So yesterday I got to do my eyebrows like without doing a live, and it was just like so calming. Like I love doing lives. Not gonna lie. <laughs> not I love doing lives. Not gonna lie. Um, but you know sometimes doing them like ooh, we're gonna use a pencil actually today. Like coming downstairs, doing your makeup without having to like talk to people or like talk about what you're doing which is like really relaxing yesterday and I was like oh this is nice because I was getting ready to go to work and I wasn't sure if I was gonna like have enough time to do a live or not so I was like nah so I just did a before and after and probably good too I used a lot of products that like Unique comes out with these really great products they're a limited edition though and like you want to keep using them but you don't want to show them off too often so I use some of my limited edition stuff because I'm like, I don't, I hate telling people, oh, that's no longer available. Oh, that's no longer available. Oh, that's no longer available. But they do it a lot. Like a lot of really great limited edition stuff, but it's amazing. Oh my God. It's awful, Sam. I feel the same way. Like it's literally been rain, rain, rain. But today was nice, but what was it doing? Oh, I didn't go outside. Also, sometimes it's, like, too hot to sit outside. I'm like, I'm going to die. I'll just go see my girl and get a spray tan. I'm fine with that. I will get a spray tan any day of the week. It's just so much easier. And you know what? It's not hard to maintain. It's really not. People are like, well, don't you have to do so much? I'm like, just don't shower for eight hours and get anything wet. You'll be fine. And actually, I notice what works best if you get it done, like, say, morning. You get it done in the morning, just go about your day and shower that night, and you're all set for the next day. And you just really are just rinsing off like all the extra stuff so it's not a big rinse off. Like don't full on shower, you're just rinsing. But I don't know when I'm going to get another spray tan. Don't know. Hopefully soon. So again, using short little highlight strokes. It doesn't really get patchy when fading and if it starts to get patchy, I just use um... A sugar scrub in the sh sh uh, bleh, in the bathroom and just kind of like scrub over once if you're really good about it stay moisturized you know stay on top of it it doesn't get patchy at all oh my god I was watching Mamma Mia now I have the Mamma Mia song stuck in my head Mamma Mia I didn't finish it yet so no one ruined it for me I've never seen it it just came out on Netflix so I've never seen Mamma Mia, so I was like, alright, I finally got to see this movie. I don't know if I'm thrilled with it or not yet. 
could have also been because I was doing a bunch of other stuff while I was like watching it so I'm not like invested but no it doesn't really get patchy Sam you should try it out just to like see because like when your wedding gets closer if you want to be a little bit more tan she does a really good job with it All right, next up, like just to see, like I know your engagement, oh, my hair is actually not doing too bad, it's a little bad. Um, I know your engagement pictures are next week, but just to kind of see like if you like it or not, don't do it for your engagement pictures because if you hate it, you're going to hate your engagement pictures, but still go check it out, it's totally worth it. All right, what is next? All right, so I'm going to show you what I do next with my luminizer. This is a little darker, this is lustrous. Hi, Kim. Uh, this is Lustrous Luminizer, so it's a little bit darker, but that's okay. It's more of a golden hue. Much more golden, okay? But I usually top it off just a tad on top of the luminizer I put on. Yeah, you are! So now I'm getting more of that bronzy look. And so now we have our highlights complete. So again, I like to do this first before my foundation, and then do my foundation, my makeup, and then I'll do the powder on top of it. I have to order another benevolent powder. But these are 50% off. They will be sold out soon. They are discontinued by the end of the month. Hello, hello, welcome. So if you've been wanting to try it, it's a big tube too. Like, look at this. This is a huge freaking tube, okay? And I've had this since it was released last year. This is a lot of product, okay? And now you're getting it for less than 20 bucks. Bam! So totally, totally worth it. And if you're a presenter, you make money back on it. So I always tell people that. All right, uh, but yeah, so that's like one of my favorite things to do with it, just to kind of top it off. But I'm gonna show you my next favorite thing because I kind of wanted to sink in while I'm doing the rest of my makeup. So don't mind me, I'm going to strip a little. So another great way to use the luminizers now I look like what's her face from Greece. You're the one that I want. All right. Uh, <laughs> so another great way to use this. This is pearly, so this is a little bit of darker one. Put it just a bit on your shoulders. Blend it in. Get your collarbone. This is pearly. I'm like not left-handed, so doing anything with my left hand, I'm like, Ooh, how do I do this? All this work just to take my dog to class tonight. And now I have that perfect glow right there, okay? I'm going to fix up my shoulders. You know, you want to highlight your shoulders. You want to show them off. Tank top season is here, guys. Like... Hi, you want to show off all that hard work or, you know, if you have nice toned shoulders, do it up. Like, do it. So then just kind of keep blending on your arm so it's not patchy. But now I have this nice glow here right now. Nice and shimmery. I'm trying to, like, make sure you guys can see it. Because, like, the mirror is, like, in a weird position. So, right on your collarbones. Ba bam And, again, you can set that, too, with the powder one if you feel more comfortable doing that. I'm choosing not to because I already have so much on. So... But yeah, isn't that great? So smart. So smart. I actually kind of stole the idea from someone else. And by someone else, I mean Rihanna. <laughs> She's got that body lava stuff out. And I'm like, wait, that's genius. And I'm like, wait, we can do that. And then it was like, wait, they're discontinuing it. Yeah. But sometimes you got to take your inspiration ideas from other people. So we have our own version of that product. And it's half off. So get it before it's gone. I'm serious. I'm so serious, guys. It's gonna be gone. Like, legit. Alright, what do I wanna do for eye makeup? I don't have any brushes to work with. Me. Oh, okay. I don't have many brushes to work with because they're all cleaning right now. Yay! So let's do a little bit of the cream eyeshadow. Um, what color do I want to do? What? I'm going to do a little bit of faithful. 
fa faithful. And this is like the tail end of it. And I use splurge too, by the way, for my eyebrows sometimes. Works amazing. I'm keeping everything nice and soft. So I'm doing just a tad of faithful. Oh my god, this Mamma Mia song needs to get out of my head. Mamma Mia, here I go again. Mama, how can I resist you? I need to finish the movie, then I can stop singing it, hopefully. Like I said, this is the tail end of this, like, container. So we gonna bland. We gonna bland like we've never blanded before. And I'm not getting rid of it because it is still a good... There's still a good amount in there for, like, at least eyebrows. Why not? Hi, Jenna. Why the heck not? All right, so. We're blending this out, and I might need to use a brush shadow, too. Like my Harry Potter brushes. My best friend got them for me. They are my Christmas present, and I love her so much for it because I love Harry Potter. All right, so let's do some pressed powder, too. Now that I found this brush. So we're going to use a little bit of Nimble, which is similar to Faithful. Just to kind of soften it out. That's working out real well. So who's going to come visit me at the bar I'm working at now? I'm so excited. Don't worry, I've never bartended before. <laughs> so I'm literally learning everything new. But I've been practicing at home. I told the owner too. I was like, well, I've been practicing your drink specials. And she laughed at me. Like in a good, like, aw, you're cute. <laughs> But I wanted to do it. Like, I've always wanted to be a bartender. So I'm like, all right, I got to do it. Like, you got to just do it. All right, we're going to use a little bit of Nonsensical, too, which is this, like, reddish-orange color. Just on the corner there. Reddish-orange, did I say? I meant reddish-brown. Oopies. I don't know what I'm talking about, apparently. Hmm. Yeah, dig it. Okay. We good. Using just a little bit to kind of line my eyes. Okay. Not doing too, too much to line my eyes. I don't like doing too, too much. I used to be such... A, like, huge, like, no, I have to have, you know, like, eyeliner. I really gotta do, I have this video in my head that I really gotta do, like, how I used to do my makeup compared to, like, how I do my makeup nowadays. Because it's a big change. It is a huge change. Quote me Billy Fusillo. Who is, like, the most annoying car salesman in all of country because he's not just in upstate New York no my mom went to Florida once one of his commercials came on yep. she was like are you kidding me she's like we want to escape him all right so we got some nice brown going we're gonna curl our lashes death trap I like curling them sometimes. Gives me a better look, if you will. It just also makes them pop a little bit more. All right, so gel transplant first. We are going to use our 3D. If you are in my VIP group, you know about my 3D deal going on. If you are not in my VIP group, please comment below. Below, below. Um, I have an amazing 3D deal going on in my VIP group. So if you're not in there, get in there. You're gonna love me for it, I swear. 
You're gonna love me. But no presenters, by the way. I have to tell people that. Cause I want to spoil my customers. You guys are amazing. First off, you tune into these things. Watch me talk a mile a minute about God knows what. And you order for me. Oh, we gotta talk about something else here, guys. Okay? This is super important. Ready? I'm 38% to green. 38% to green. 38% to green. Hi, Jenny. Is a huge freaking deal. Okay? Huge freaking deal. Let me tell you about this. So, if I hit green by the end of this month, I get a pay raise. I get a car bonus. I get top 2% of the company. I'm going to roll this on the back of my hand. I get to walk the stage at convention and show off how awesome I am at my little makeup biz that people make fun of me for. <laughs> um, I know you guys don't. <laughs> I'm just, I'm a little angry at some people today and I'm just kind of like, mm, I really shouldn't be doing that and I'm sorry. You guys are amazing. So, all right, let's do our lashes. So yeah, so I am so close to hitting green status, okay? I wanted to hit it so bad last month for my birthday, but I did not. But I was like, you know what? It's okay. We're going to move on. We're going to do it. We're still going to do it, okay? And this is honestly the closest I have been in the soonest amount of time since I joined this company, okay? Usually I'm like 30% like two days before the end of the month. And I'm just like still maintaining that hope. Like I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And of course it hasn't happened yet. But I am still putting it out there into the gods of the makeup world and saying I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I walk around here and I'm just like I'm going to hit green. I'm going to hit green. Hey guess what? I'm going to hit green. Going to hit green. And I will tell people that religiously. Because it's huge. It's a big deal. What is this? Coat 2? Yeah. It is a big deal. When you hit green status with this company, you are just like showered in goodness. Okay? So green is like, I'm so freaking close. So that's why I have a great deal going on in my VIP group. But another thing is, I don't even know what I was about to say. <laughs> I like froze. I'm like, another thing, dot, dot, dot. Um, but no, so that's why I have a great deal going on in my VIP group. No presenters. Um, and that's why, like, this whole Luminizer coming out, like, it's going to be taken out of rotation soon. It's also a big deal. Hi, Katie. It's also a big deal because that's, like, you can do so much in this company with buying just, like, a Luminizer, okay? And then I get paid three hours after. So I'm still trucking. I'm still going to get it. I know I'm going to get it. I know I'm going to get it. All right, so this is two coats of the 3D. Two coats. Two coats. And then I'm going to do my bottom lashes. I'm 38% of 100%. Yes. So I'm 38% of the way there, but it, like I said, it's a big freaking deal, okay? Big freaking deal. I've seen crazier things happen. I've seen people like go from like zero to 60 in like a month. So we'll see what happens. I'm just kind of combing through these. They're clumping a little bit for me. I'm not kidding. Yes, every month, if you don't hit it, you do go back to zero, but you can still build up from that. So every month we kind of like restart, everyone restarts, every black status person out there, which is like the creme de la creme, you know, these are the people who are pulling like six, seven figures a month um, or a year. All these people, we all start back at zero. We all start back at square one. That's what I like about it too. Like you get like a clean slate, if you will. So you kind of like say you don't hit it and it's like everything that could go wrong that month for you went wrong. You get a clean slate. Okay. So you can still keep building and it's also like say the people you haven't spoken to like, 
you know, you follow up with people like, hey, what'd you think? Hey, what'd you think? And you just kind of keep going. But I'm really hoping to get it this month. I think I calculated I need to sell like 900 mascaras. <laughs> I was like, okay. Hi, Joanne. Did I say hi? I don't think I did. <clears throat> Sally. But you guys are the bomb.com first off for like joining me on this. Second off for falling in love with these amazing products because they are amazing. So you guys rock. All right, so let me just roll this again on the back of my hand. So we did two coats. So we gotta do two coats again. But see, look at that. Like this is from just the gel transplant. Now I have, I'm gonna brighten this a little bit. So this is just gel transplant. This is with the fibers. Hello. Like, good morning. Hi, Leanne. So hopefully I get it. So if you guys need anything, you have any questions, let's talk. And I'm gonna remain optimistic, so none of you are in my parade, okay? I will forever see the glass half full or in my case it is 38% full and that is 38% more than it could be it's 38% more than empty so I will always remain positive you can ask my girls on my team I'm like oozing positivity all the time they're kind of like shut up <laughs> but that's how you gotta be in this business you gotta keep staying positive yo lash is coming out much better than the other lash why 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 do you want to change me now country song so happy we sold our piece of country tickets yesterday we're not going we decided not to go. Too much going on, and I was like, not even gonna bother. Plus, it's expensive. By the way, I'm topping this off with a little bit of Epic, just to kind of make them go kabam. Cause that is a word. Alright, so next up is a lip color. What lip color should I do? What lip color? What lip color? What lip color? What do I want to do today? Should I do blue? No. Um, I want to do something nice and summery because this look is very like, I feel like I just got off a beach. Like, hey guys, I just got off a beach. No biggie. In May. <laughs> um, what lip color? I have an idea, but I gotta find it. Natural. There's one color like I really want to do, and I just gotta find it. I like natural. Nope, those I have two of the same of that. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Nope. The amount of lips. Yeah! Is that it? Yes. Okay. Extravagant. So it is a natural, but it's like a peachy natural. That's a lot peachier than I thought it was going to be. That's okay, though. I like this color. Let me see. Do I have a lip liner that'll kind of tone that down a little? I should, or I thought I did. Well, oh well. But no, this is like a nice bright color. I like it. I like it. Um, oh wait. We'll use Prim Eyeliner.
So we're using a little bit of brown eyeliner. Don't worry, I'm gonna fix it. Just go over that once more with the lipstick. So it's not so like, weird looking. Hi Allie. So we have a little bit of a darker color going on. I still feel like it's not doing what I want it to do. Hmm. What can we do here to fix that a little bit more? Ooh, I have an idea. Eyeshadow. I know, right? Eyeshadow. What is she talking about? There we go. So now we got a little bit of an ombre lip going on. So not too crazy. Nice and nice. Oh yeah, I was thinking that actually too. A shimmery shadow in the middle. Let's do that. That'll fix that a little more. Good call. Good call. Mm, let's do a little bit of opportunistic. bit. And what's nice about that too, when you use eyeshadow, you're actually like setting your makeup. So you're setting your lipstick. So now this shouldn't move. Shouldn't be the operative word. I don't know. I like it when I'm not 100% sold. Maybe just because it still kind of looks like, like, you know, like the look that was popular for a while where like you had dark lip gloss or the dark lip liner and then like, like nothing in the middle. You know what I'm talking about? Like the gloss. I don't know, but I like it. I think it's good. I think it's good for today. All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget, 50% off till the end of the month. 50% off. You guys don't want to miss out on this. Look at this beautiful glow I got with it, okay? And my shoulders are glowing. My collarbones are glowing. I'm glowing all over. Um, so if you guys have any questions at all about the products, let me know. If you have any questions at all about the deal going on. Again, I do have a really great deal going on in my VIP group. So if you're not in there, comment VIP. No presenters, please. And in the meantime, have a great Thursday. Bye.